I'm not going to lie, this video is going to be a pretty difficult one for me, especially since we do have a lot of information to go over regarding about the Neo Knight situation. I'm sure you guys remembered about the drama involving with a popular FNF YouTuber along with two Google documents being brought up against them. And yeah, it did have to involve with Neo Knight and they are a big FNF channel and a big person within the community as well. And they do specialize in those types of videos where they have those characters switch out between the mods. It's really cool content. The documents also went along to state that Neo Knight was being rude to their fans within their Discord server and that Neo Knight said a potential racist slur on Twitter which seemed to have angered many people within their own community as well. Well on today's video I am here to report that the drama video that we posted a couple days ago does have a lot of misinformation revealed within it. And there is quite a bit of stuff that we do have to clear up from the drama. It first starts over on Twitter with a lot of you guys tagging me and also mentioning me regarding your thoughts about the situation. And it really clicked in my mind. I can't even begin to count the amount of messages I got from you all confirming and bringing up that the term Grinjo was not a slur, especially within the Spanish slash Latino community. I mean, a lot of you guys even commented on that video saying your thoughts as well, and it really clicked into my mind. The whole reason why I believed the document and why I thought the word was a slur was ultimately due to the American culture and how the word is being used within our society. And they also got this website over here that also claims, along with other websites, saying that that word is indeed a slur. But I did fail to recognize that the word is a confusion conflicting one between different cultures. In the Spanish culture, it's not that bad of a word at all, but in the American culture, it can be. It ultimately does depend on the context whether or not how the word is used. I mean, even Neonite had a response to this by tweeting out saying that the term is not a racial slur and that they were not going to apologize for it. I mean, they had no reason to. Upon research, it's not even a bad word in their culture. And you also even have Shadow Mario, a member within the FNF community that had a big point regarding about the situation as well that deserves to be mentioned. Grinjo is not a racist word. It's a Latin American slang that basically means stranger. Y'all Grinjos should stop picking a fight over stuff you don't even use or claim because this is getting ridiculous. I mean the proof is right here with Let Create that it is a colloquial for American but it's not a slur as explained by the Oxford Language Dictionary. I mean, we could literally go through hundreds of messages that you guys have sent over on Twitter as well as on the video explaining about this and you guys are 100% right about this. It's just a term for a foreigner, that is all. But yeah, along with that, I was able to get in contact with Neonite themselves over on Discord in order to discuss about the situation at hand. And ultimately, in order to get their thoughts and also their point of view of the situation, which I'm not going to lie, that's something that I should have done before I even made that video. But they did have a big response to go over that they wanted me to share with you guys on today's video as well. Hi, just wanted to talk to you regarding your last video about me. There is some misinformation in the situation and I am gonna explain what really happened. Number one, yes. I did hire a guy from Fiverr to help me set up and upgrade the new Discord server. Don't see any problem with it. It's my money and it's nothing illegal either. I mean, I do agree with that. It is their own Discord server. They are the owner. They do own their money. You know what I mean? They can do whatever they want to that server. He is the owner after all. Number two, there is no crypto bot or something like that in the server. I don't know where they got that from. Just makes it look like they're saying random things to try to get me cancelled. 
And in fact, if we do look into the Google documents, we don't have any screenshots or even proof on the matter regarding about those crypto bots being within their own Discord server. It's again, something I should have noticed while scanning through and also doing some research within those documents. Number three, I admit I was kind of rude to some of the staff members. It was because I was under stress of all the unnecessary hate I was getting. I even tried apologizing personally, but was called a manipulator by some members. I ended up banning some people too because of bringing up this controversy and trying to make me look bad. I was tired. Now that point is understandable, but I did talk to Neo Knight about that specifically, and I ultimately did tell him that if things do get crazy to the point that they did, it's just best to step away for a little bit of time to settle down and not contribute to the fire. I mean, we are supposed to be role models within the community, and honestly, doing that what he did was not a good way to portray his image. Number four, there is nothing wrong with having a casino bot in the server. It doesn't involve real money, and it's just another fun economy bot that many servers have. And number five, Grinjo is not a racial slur, so I'm not going to apologize for for that. It's just a way to call people from the United States, or in some cases any foreigner. This is a very common term in Latin America. That tweet wasn't even related to the situation, it was because of another drama. But yeah, I do want to apologize to multiple people watching the video, but firstly I do want to apologize to Neo Knight themselves. I am really sorry about all the added stress I said touring your way, especially with that whole drama video the other day ago. Going through the documents and going even deeper within them, you didn't do anything that bad at all, and the whole situation was just over dramatic. Like, I am going to take accountability on this one. I should have done better to go through those documents and in order to pick out proof from those documents as well. It's just something that I made a failed mistake, you know? I just made a mistake and failed to act upon it. I am also sorry for my Spanish audience as well watching the video because a huge part of my audience are Spanish speaking viewers. And I'm sure that a lot of you guys got to that point in the video where you did saw that Grinjo part being mentioned. And you might have thought that I was going crazy for thinking that that term was a slur when in your culture it's not even a bad word at all. And I am also sorry for you guys watching the video right now and also to the FNF community as well for just bringing in more drama that really shouldn't have even been here in the first place. It's not a whole lot that we get these drama situation videos or these news videos so wrong to the point where we have to do an update and also an apology on it, but mistakes do happen and unfortunately I did do a lot of mistakes on that previous video. There's nothing really much that I can do other than taking accountability and really learning from my mistakes and preventing this from happening again in the future. I do want to thank you all for providing your thoughts though because if it wasn't for you guys bringing awareness and speaking out I wouldn't have even known about it in the first place. But other than that take care everybody and enjoy the weekend.